Good morning, everyone. This is Ben Dunn, founder of Antarctic Press, creator of such comics as Warrior Nun, Mighty Tiny, Ninja High School, Tomorrow Girl, Marvel Mongoverse, and a host of other comics. So, I've been thinking about those old comic book superheroes. I'm working on Tomorrow Girl right now. So I kept thinking about those old Silver Age comics, and I kept thinking about what were the real reasons that comic book superheroes became so popular? Well, it was basically a simple battle of good versus evil. And I thought to myself, well, what exactly is evil? I mean, I guess broken down into simplest terms, at least in my opinion. Feel free to disagree with me if you do, if if you want to. But for me, evil is simply you know, wanting or wishing or doing, you know, egregious harm to a fellow human being that has done nothing to you. I mean, when you think about it, it's just a matter of degrees, really. <clears throat> you know, we live on a planet with what? Seven billion people or so. We all have to live sort of together. You know, resources are limited, as they say. You know, but our capacity for ingenuity and our ability to harm one another is unlimited. You know, the comic book villains of the past usually had some sort of nefarious plan that involved either self-gain or uh, at the expense of others. You know, wanting to do harm on others, basically. You know, wanting to do harm on others that have done nothing to you. You know, oh, you know, uh, at least to you personally. You know, you may feel a sense of wanting to get back. Sure, we all do, but that's what the law is for. You know, you get back through the justice system, not through revenge, not through personal vendetta. You know, because if that were to happen, then we'd basically be no better than our caveman ancestors, where the strong survived and the weak perished. You know, superheroes were meant to uphold good. You know, basically trying to prevent harm to others that we do not know ourselves. You know, it's it's one thing to protect your family, your loved ones, your friends. It's another thing to selflessly sacrifice yourself or to defend someone you don't know. That's truly a sign of someone that is good. You know, I see so many people acting out in ways that I find, quite frankly, evil. You know, the, uh, the way they behave, the way they treat others they don't even know. It, it just seems antithetical to being a human being, you know, to be at least a decent, hu good human being. You know, I, I try to often think that maybe those old comic book superheroes had something there. They were trying to instill some sort of value in its early readers to show that, you know, you, you be good, you know, fight evil, you know, and if you're thinking about, if you, if you thinking about, you know, wanting to do harm, cause chaos, destruction, you know, hurt people, kill people, you know, and without, with people you don't even know, you know, just for whatever selfish, motivated reason you have, then you truly are evil. Yeah. So anyway, this is my thought for the day. Agree or disagree? Hmm. It's up to you. I'm just one guy with an opinion. So uh, until next time, this is Ben Dunn, signing off.